Hello friends. In this video, I'm going to go over how to draw basic shapes with DaVinci Resolve. Shapes like a circle, rectangle, or an arrow. You might use these shapes to highlight some object in a video clip. I'm going to go over how to draw the shapes once and then reuse them in multiple clips, wherever you need them. I'll also go over how to reuse the shapes in multiple projects. Make sure to stick around to the end to see how to do that. To draw shapes that are easy to reuse in multiple clips and easy to animate in the edit page, create the shapes in a separate fusion composition. I'm in the edit tab with a clip on the timeline. Open the effects library and click on effects and drag in a fusion composition. Then click on the Fusion button. In Fusion, visual effects are represented by nodes on this node diagram. This is the media output node. The output node is connected to this monitor, which is currently blank. To connect a monitor to a node, click on one of the two dots below the node. Right dot for the right monitor and the left dot for the left monitor. The most commonly used nodes can be found on this shelf here. To draw a circle, drag in the ellipse node and a background node and connect them like this. To change the color, select the background node, click on the color tool and pick a color. To make it into an outline, select the ellipse node, uncheck solid, and change the border width. We only need to create a basic shape here. Final changes to size and position can be made in the edit page. To draw a rectangle, drag in the rectangle tool and a background node. Connect them like this. To change the color, select the background node, click on the color tool, and pick a color. To make it into an outline, select the rectangle node, uncheck solid, and change the border width. To draw an arrow, drag in a polygon tool and a background node. Connect them like this. To change the color, select the background node, click on the color button, and pick a color. Add a grid to make it easier to draw. Select the background node, type in shift space, type in grid, and click add. Select the polygon and draw the shape. You can move any of the points if needed. Select the grid and press delete to remove the grid. When the shape is finished, go back to the edit page. To change when the shape appears and exits, drag the ends of the fusion clip like this. To change the size and position, open the inspector and change these controls by dragging them. like this. To animate the size and position over time, use keyframes. Set keyframes by clicking on these diamonds. Then move the playhead to the end of the clip and back one frame. Then change the values of these uh, settings here.
Let's try that. Okay, that looks good. To share the shape across multiple clips and projects, save a copy of it before making any changes in the edit page. Click view and enable show power bins. Power bins are like folders that are visible across projects. It is off by default. Drag the clip to the power bin. Give it a useful name like red circle. Let's change the size of the shape in this clip. And drag in a copy of the original and change its size and position. Now we have two copies of the shape. And that is how to draw basic shapes in DaVinci Resolve. I hope you found this video useful. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Leave any comments and questions below. And thanks for watching. See you next time.